The instrument cluster on your Genesis provides up-to-the-minute information and control of vehicle functions and features. The digital cluster can be configured for either a 2D or 3D effect. Genesis recommends you familiarize yourself with the 3D cluster before driving with it. To turn the 3D cluster on or off, select Setup, then Vehicle, then Cluster, then 3D Cluster. Here you can select Maximum, Normal, or Off, depending on your preference. It may sometimes be difficult to read information on the 3D cluster, such as when you are wearing polarized sunglasses. A full list of situations can be found in the Owner's Manual. In these instances, you should change the cluster to 2D to ensure safe driving. The display can also be set to different themes. You can set the display to change according to drive mode, or set it to one of the three preset themes. The left side of the instrument cluster holds the speedometer, as well as the fuel gauge. The currently selected gear is also displayed here, as is the estimated distance until empty. The right side of the instrument cluster holds the tachometer, as well as the engine temperature display. Below these is the vehicle odometer. In the central bottom area, the average fuel economy is shown, as well as the instant fuel economy. The central LCD area can show a variety of information and feature selections. It is controlled by the LCD display button and the LCD control switch on the steering wheel. Pressing the LCD display button changes the view mode in this area. Driving Assist view displays the status of the vehicle's driving assist systems. Turn-by-turn -turn view displays the state of the navigation. Utility view displays driving information such as the trip distance, the digital speedometer, and tire pressure. You can use the up-down OK switch to move between different sets of information. Pressing and holding the switch can reset fields such as trip distance, average fuel economy, and others. In Utility View, you can also choose which items you want displayed. Go to the Select Content screen, then press and hold OK. Now you can select or deselect items to show in Utility View. The Option menu can be selected by pressing and releasing the OK switch. The Option menu allows you to check vehicle warning messages, choose between 2D and 3D for the instrument cluster, activate or deactivate the head-up display, or display the driver assistance menu on the touchscreen display. You can also select some of the cluster content information from the cluster menu within the vehicle settings. Wiper lights display will inform when the wipers and lights are on. Blind spot view turns the blind spot view monitor on and off. For more on this feature, see the blind spot view monitor video. Icy road warning will notify you when outside temperatures could lead to icy roads. You can also turn on or off the welcome sound for when the cluster turns on or off. Finally, warning lights are positioned in different areas on the instrument cluster. Consult your owner's manual for information regarding specific warning lights. For more helpful information on your Genesis, be sure to explore the how-to guides on the Genesis USA YouTube channel and mygenesis.com.